with your daughter In the morning, do karate in the water This sounds a samurai's Rocket shorts in the winter, don't fuck with splinters Roll with sinners, a bunch of winners Catered lunch and dinners Why my truck jar looks so empty Drop a hook and then I'll probably cop an M3 Long night, that's in the event Somebody tried to get me, then to heaven they'll be sent Oh, off the strength Yo, what's going on? It's your boy, Julian Rodriguez, also known as Juice Manji. And today I'm bringing you the Air Jordan 1 SB Quick Strike, the Lance Mountain paint sneakers, not walls collaboration. This is, um, this is the black pair, obviously. I do not have the white pair. Uh, I, want, I want them very much, but I was able to get my hands on these. Um, over at uh, Nike Santa Monica and I'm very 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 happy with this shoe um, this is the kind of leather quality that we've you know that I that I kind of demand from Jordan brand um, you know we haven't really gotten it at all think now we got the uh, the remastered collection coming next year but that's neither here nor there we're talking about these um, you know the first uh, Jordan 1 SB collaboration didn't really uh, it was underwhelming. It had Jordan brand leather, not SB quality uh, materials. But this is more in line with what Nike SB does, and uh, I love the concept. You know, the concept coming from you know back in the 80s. Uh, you didn't have brands making skateboarding shoes, uh, so a lot of these guys down here in Southern California were wearing um, were wearing Jordan ones because it had a lot of padding. Uh, it was good for big jumps and, and, and that shock absorption that you need. Um, you know, it's, it was similar to the kind of uh, things that basketball players were looking for in shoes. Um, so basically, you know, what they would do, they'd, mi they'd mismatch them and paint them uh, to keep them looking looking newer just to kind of add their own flair to them. And so that's, the, uh, that's why you have the mismatched and with the black uh, overlay of paint that under each shoe reveals one bread Jordan 1 and 1 Royal Jordan 1. Um, so it's a very cool concept. Uh, Lance Mountain being born in Pasadena, my stomping grounds. I fucks with it double, double time. Um, but yeah, let's get into the shoe. You all know what a Jordan 1 looks like, but as you can see, in little perforation, the little perforations show the red shining through, as well as just every other, any part where the leather on a red panel ends. You can so on the swoosh and on the back part of the shoe you could totally see the red coming through um, you know we saw this kind of uh, concept on the Statue of Liberty uh, SB Dunk High from Fuse back I think it was 2010 damn I'm getting old but yeah that, I think that was, it was 2010 um, but yeah so that was where we first saw it and it's gone quite well um, mine have actually aged very nicely and I'll show you them at the end of the video I like the natural creasing and, and the way the colors come through. So that's what I'm gonna do with these. I'm not going to um, scuff them or do any kind of custom stuff. I'm just gonna let the natural wear process kinda make these, um, make these age nicely. Here's the blue shoe. And again, same thing. You can see the blue leather on the edge of the uh, panels where it's blue under the black. It's very, very cool concept on this shoe. And you got your Nike SB branding right there. And then your paint walls or paint sneakers not walls on each insole. And each shoe comes with one lace to match the color. So you got your blue there and your red on this one. Awesome concept. Um, so here's the toe box on my Statue of Liberty SBs. I've done no kind of like scratching on these intentional kind of uh, scratching and customizing. This is just natural wear, so it's coming through. Now this is a little different because on this shoe, I didn't want it really to be coming through as much. I kind of wanted to just do my thing with them. Um, so it's gonna look a little um, a little different. Uh, you know, the, the Jordans I'll be a little bit more, I'll, I won't be as careful with them. You know, these I, was, I just wear like any other shoe, try to keep them from getting scuffed. You know, I, 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 I was a little more careful with these than I will be with the Jordans because um, I like just the solid uh, tone on these. I didn't want too much copper coming through. I'll show you the other shoe. This one, 
has a little bit more right here, which is dope. Um, I, I like the way it wears in and I like the way it creases. And for me, these classic shoes, your Jordan 3s, your Jordan 1s, your Dunks, I think they, uh, I think they age really well. I think they look better um, with some good wear. So there you have it. Um, you know, just a really solid, well put together shoe, really clean colorway. Um, you know, that, that, uh, that they did, they, the construction's good, the quality's good, the, uh, the materials are nice, and, uh, and you just, I'm really happy with it. Um, you know, I'm uh, staying on the lookout for my size 10 in the uh, white pair, ready to pull the trigger whenever those come to me in a good price. You know, don't, it's a buyer's market for these if you're looking for these. Don't pay, uh, don't be paying 300 um, you know, no, there's, there's way more, uh, way more pairs available than people who are willing to pay anything close to that. You know, you can, you'll be able to hold out and get these shoes. I think it, it, if you're, if you're on it and you're patient, uh, you should be able to get these shoes for no more than, than 250 shipped, um, in time. So just stick with it and, uh, hopefully you guys can cop a pair. They go true to size and they're just really comfortable, really great shoe. Um, I'm going to beat the hell out of these in fall. Um, so maybe I will, uh, give you guys a an updated look at them um, but yeah that just about does it stick around for the uh, on foot portion of this video thanks for watching y'all hit me up at juice manji on twitter uh, and hit me up in the comments and I will catch you all in the next vid thanks for watching peace Porsche taste all the beans are getting bust and baked on thin ice I skate across the lake with the CCM tags my feet are like cashes smoke premium cabbage blow a kiss to my dick wash my body with the sponge feed me flavor rice put the chronic in my lungs tailor me a leather suit on some Jodeci shit 